ain't really. They come suddenly, without warning. I don't know how many doctors I've seen. Migraine? Migraine medication doesn't help. Tension headaches, please. I'm fine most of the time, but then it hits. It hits right behind my eye. It attacks me, like some tiny demon with an ice pick, stabbing my eye. It comes without warning, without pity, without remorse. It attacks me in the car once. I crash it into a parked car. I got sued. Really? It's not fair. It wasn't my fault. When it attacks, my eyes water and my nose runs. I can't see. All I can feel is the stabbing, angry pain that tries to pop my eye. It happened once at my job. I screamed. Everyone thought it was crazy. All it takes is just one thing doing something out of the norm and I'm labeled as crazy. No one understands. I can't sleep. I can't work. I can't drive. I just want for the demon I just wait for the demon to attack. I tried medication. Really, I did everything they told me. Pain medication, seizure medications, yoga, meditation, everything. I tried drugs, all of them. Really, uh, I tried marijuana, precocet, even heroin. My demon just laughs at my drugs. I got caught. I got caught with my pet coat. My parents thought I was, I'm a criminal. I'm, it's not my fault. It's the demon. It's always the demon. He screeches. He's coming. I don't know when. I don't know where. But he's always coming back. The anticipation is almost worse than the stab. All day I just walk. I just wait for the demon. Sometimes he comes, sometimes he doesn't. I think he's just laughing at me. It's not fair. I didn't ask for this. One doctor said it was an ice pick headache. Well, that's what it feels like. A demon with an ice pick. A demon stabbing me. I hate him. I thought I could stab him back. I didn't want to go out without a fight, you know. So I got my own ice pick. I got my own ice pick and sliced it out my eye. Can you imagine plucking out your own eye? But it didn't help. It didn't help. I know. I don't know what else to do. Suicide, maybe? But maybe I can get rid of my demon by finding him a new home. Maybe he'll like someone else. Maybe he'll. He'll move on and I'll be free. I get, I'll get, finally get my life back. I know it's not fair, but it's not fair that I have to go through this. It's not fair. Maybe if someone else feels an ice pick through their eye, they'll understand. Maybe the demon will go with them away. That's why you're here. I'm really sorry. I am. But I don't know what else to do. Please stop struggling. It's just going to make things worse.